Hi, it's Mark out here with you this morning on this beautiful sunny uh, October morning here in my backyard, the area of endless repair projects. So whatever you see behind you over here, including the dogs and any kind of thing that you see uh, might need to be cleaned up or repaired, just try to ignore that. Uh, because I just want to show you something pretty simple today. Uh, for about uh, five years, I have done personal concealed carry evaluations for clients all across the United States. Uh, these are people that would send me information about themselves. I would take that information and put together an evaluation of what would work for them as far as concealed carry went. Uh, three different uh, types of handguns generally, several different types of carry methods that would work for them based on the information they gave me. Uh, one of the things that uh, people often wrote to me about, and it, before I go into that, let me just say this, it, it's, it's important that you understand that if you're, you haven't carried a gun much, or if you're, you're trying to decide what to carry, how to carry, it's always more important to get the gun that you can shoot first and shoot well, get a good grip on and control, and then work everything else around that, including your clothing. But if you can get the, the, the type of carry method, the type of carry gear that you need to go with the clothes that you wear all the time, that's even better provided that you can carry the gun you need to carry with it. So I had a lot of people that would let me know, you know, I, I need to know what kind of clothing they generally wore. And from time to time they would tell me that they wore something just about like I've got on right here, workout clothes, uh, either casually or because they worked in some kind of facility somewhere where they did therapy or they worked at a gym or something where they wore this type of clothing, workout clothes. Uh, and so what I've got today here is I'm going to show you if you wear this type of clothing a lot or if you, any, on any day that you, you think you'd like to, uh, you know, you need to wear this kind of clothes around but you want to carry your gun on body, I'll show you how to carry a really decent gun, decent sized gun, a gun that you can get a good, a good grip on and carry it in this type of clothing concealed without any significant problems. What I'm going to be doing it with is the gun I'm going to be using to show to demonstrate it is the Smith & Wesson Shield. This is a Smith & Wesson. This is a <laughs> this is a clear gun, by the way. It's the Smith & Wesson Shield um, in 45. It, it carries seven shots. You can get a full grip on this gun with my average size hands. I can get a full grip on this gun. If somebody with bigger hands can get a full grip on it, and if I was going to carry in these type clothes, this is a gun I'd be carrying. Now, what do you do it with? Well, I'm going to show you here in just a minute. I'm going to demonstrate it. I'm going to demonstrate carrying it in this type of clothing with a Caldwell belly band. A lot of times people see these type of, of, uh, of carry devices and they just discount them as something frivolous or that wouldn't work. This is about $20 and uh, I'm going to assure you of one thing. You can carry your gun in this device right here and you can carry it a lot of different ways that you might not be able to carry another in a, with other holsters discreetly based on what type of clothing you have. So I'm going to put this on, I'm going, to, I'm going to put the gun in it, and I'm going to show you how it works, and I'm going to show you the ideal way to carry it in this type of clothing. So hold on for just a minute, and I'll be right back. Okay, I now have the gun, I'm carrying the gun now. Now what I want to, I want to show you here, this what I want to point out is, this, this is this is not real loose clothing, it's not real tight either, except for I've got a compression shirt on, a red one, so you can see the gun when I pull my shirt up here. Uh, but I'm wearing a seven shot 45 semi-automatic pistol that I can get a full grip on right now. And if you were standing right here in front of me, I don't think from the camera angle, I don't think you can see the gun. And if you were standing right here in front of me, I don't think you'd be able to see it either. Because a lot of times, well, actually always, if you see these type of devices, these type holsters in an ad somewhere, whether it's this one or some other uh, manufacturers, what you're going to see is you have them pictured up around here with people wearing the guns up under their arms or back here in a cross draw position, which you can do all that with this belly band. Um, under a, you know, if you're wearing jeans under a big shirt or something, you can, you can do that with this. But if you want to carry it with these type clothes right here, this belly band is ideal, but not worn around where you normally see them shown. Where I've got this one is right here at my waistline. I've got it around my waistline with the pants pulled up over them, tied tightly around the band, the top of the band, and the gun is sitting right here. Here is where the gun is, right here. The gun is accessible, it's hidden, I can walk around all day in this, I can sit down, it's comfortable. 
Uh, <laughs> I could go in, I could forget it on. I've got it on and go in and go to sleep in it. It's that comfortable, it's that easy to wear, and it's that effective because you don't see this gun. It's, this is a, a small gun to begin with. It's a what you would call a large semi-automatic, or I'm sorry, a large uh, subcompact. Um, but nonetheless, it's plenty of gun for civilian self-defense under most conditions. So if this is the kind of clothing that you like to wear, there's nothing wrong. Get you a belly band, either a Caldwell like this one, um, cost you about $20. And let me tell you about one thing about these, when you put them on and you want to wear a gun like this right here, or anywhere on your body with one of these tight bands, you have to put it on very tightly. Now, when I say tightly, that doesn't mean it hurts you or cuts your hair off when you put it on. You can stretch it as tight as you want to. It, it has a Velcro closure, and when you get done and, and put it on and, and get everything back in place, it doesn't squeeze you like it's gonna break your ribs or cut your hair off. So no matter how tight you get it, it's still comfortable. It's soft, it's pliable, it doesn't, it doesn't add any bulk, and you can walk around all day long and do any kind of movement, climb, sit, stand, kneel, lie down, whatever you want to do, and still get to that gun that you need if it ever comes down to it. The Caldwell belly band in this position where you see this one right here, right at my waistline with my pants tied around it, with a shirt, a cover shirt over that, my workout clothes on, and my gun in place hardly a better way to carry a gun on body, a semi-automatic pistol, than with a Caldwell belly band or some belly band that you can put at waist level, pull your pants up, tuck your gun in it, and go about your business as long as you want to all day long. The Caldwell belly band, it's a good choice to carry a good pistol. Get you one, you won't be sorry if you need to carry a gun in this type of casual clothing. I'm Mark Rogers, Christian gun owner, and I'll see you soon.